be speakers all throughout the field and it'll be really loud. You won't be able to hear anything. And then uh, if we're not doing that, we'll we'll try to eliminate talking. So, so take out the sound, but just nobody can talk or quarterback only whispers, stuff like that. So they'll try to practice without being able to hear. Who picks the music? I'm not sure, actually. I think Coach Arbol. Is it good what music? Kind of music? <laughs> sometimes it is. Sometimes it's uh, it's good music, but sometimes it's awful. So I think I think the days of Coach Harbaugh picks is really good. What's on there? What does he pick? <laughs> Just you know, playlist of good music and rock and roll. <laughs> I don't know. It's a, it's a variation of stuff. They might have it on the radio station. I'm not sure. You haven't heard the record previously with you know communication on the road. How's how has it been in general? Is there anything you've had to address or anything like that? Uh, yeah, we struggled a little bit last week. The uh, atmosphere was a little bit more than we were expecting. We didn't expect it to be that loud, so it got to us at times. Um, we had to adjust throughout the game of going to a silent cadence and stuff like that, but. Uh, I mean, we've been, we're preparing for this game because we know this play, place is loud. We played there uh, two years ago, and it gets it gets real loud. Do you remember at what point you guys decided to make that switch? Like, what kind of – how does that play itself out when you decide to go somewhere? Uh, I think we had a false start because we couldn't hear the cadence. So we came to the sideline, and we decided that we are going to go to sound count. So it was in the middle of a drive. It wasn't in between? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. It's some, somewhere in the middle of the game. We just decided we have to do that. How much, How much? I guess with familiarity with Jake having played many games and things like that, when you look back at Utah, how far have you guys kind of come in terms of dealing with those things on the road, you know, in, in live action, uh, uh, dealing with Jake? I think we've come a long ways, everything offensively. Uh, <clears throat> that was a hard game to start the season, <laughs> season off with, a tough place to play, but um, I think we've improved a lot. Jake's gotten a lot better, uh, been real consistent, and last two games were career highs for him so um, but I mean I think everyone's getting better all year playing in those hundred thousand plus stadiums like Ohio Stadium here Beaver Stadium you know can you compare and contrast those atmospheres what's different about each of them um well Penn State is special uh, I mean that place is I think it's known for being loud it's gonna be a I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a wideout game or <laughs> something like that uh, last time we played there is also a wideout game and, the students love that. The fans love it, so they're going to be uh, they be ready to go. But you know, all loud stadiums are the same. You can't hear. You can't hear. There's no difference. What makes their front so uh, so tough? Uh, they don't have any weak links. You know, all front seven are good. Um, their defense ends are really good. Their interior guys are really good, and they got really good backers. So it's going to be a challenge for offensive line, fullbacks, tight ends. Everybody has to block. It's going to be a challenge. Do you remember some of that from the last couple of years, like things that they've done at the line of scrimmage? Is it, is it strength? Is it technique? Um, I mean, some of the guys are returning. Uh, a lot, of, a couple of them are new. So, as far as one-on-one -on -one battles, not too much. But uh, they're just a good team. They're well coached. They're disciplined, and they play hard. They play physical. And I mean, they're going to be excited for this game. I think it's senior night also, so it'll be a lot of emotion. Do you like playing on the road? Yeah, I play in front of our crowd better, but uh, it's fun to go into a hostile environment and kind of be like the bad guys or something like that, you know, it's cool, but I like playing at home better.